Back tonight, we head to Jacksonville, where police are urging community members to be on alert after vandals hit several houses this week alone. Investigators say they damaged and stole Christmas decorations in people's homes. Cameron Edgeworth is there. Police tell me four houses hit Tuesday night and one on Thursday night. Police say some of the people responsible could still be on the streets. Tanya Miller and her family shaken up after a group of teens damaged several decorations outside their home on Louise Drive Tuesday night. This is Ruby's birthday soon. Miller says the hardest part was breaking the news to her children about what happened. And I didn't sleep that night trying to think about how I was going to tell them what I was going to tell them, how it was going to affect them. Jacob Ragoon shared this surveillance video with CBS 40. Jacksonville police apprehended a few teens on Thursday. They will not face criminal charges. Jacksonville Assistant Police Chief Bill Wynum says homeowners should take extra measures to secure items and think about investing in a video surveillance system. Take a picture of everything. Take a picture of the serial number. You know, because that's a permanent record. That way we do have something to go on. Miller says she hopes whoever is responsible will learn from this and others will understand how their actions impact others. I love, you know, making my kids happy and the, having the decorations just puts the icing on the cake for them. And um, to see that destroyed, I mean, it completely like sucked the Christmas spirit out of me. If you know anything about these crimes, you're asked to call Jacksonville Police. Reporting in Jacksonville, Cameron Edgeworth, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.